Good morning class. Good morning everyone. In this video, I'm going to share with you how to use the pocket tool in FreeCAD and to draw the six views in FreeCAD. We will draw in the front, top, right, rear, bottom, and left view. To start creating a design in FreeCAD, you simply click here at the workbench and then select the part design okay after clicking the part design you click create new okay so then click create body and then create sketch and then select a plane where you're going to draw your design okay so for instance you're going to draw on the xy plane click here and then you click okay okay so for instance we're going to draw a cube and then we're going to draw a design each of these six views okay so we can for instance select here click the arrow down and then click the centered rectangle click and then point your mouse pointer at the center and then hold down your left mouse button and then drag okay so for instance you release your mouse and then click and then to remove the active tool you just simply right click anywhere here right click okay so next you're going to set the dimension for a perfect cube okay so for instance here select this line and then select this horizontal distance constraint click this one and then type 30 30 millimeter and then click here the vertical distance you click and then click here and then you type 30 to make it a perfect cube and then click okay so next thing you're going to do is to click close here click close and then click the pad tool click this one and then set the dimension for the length to 30 you type 30 millimeter so that you can have a perfect cube and then click ok so this time you have already a perfect cube with 30 millimeter is the dimension ok so for example you're going to draw we will start on the front view okay so just you can click this one that means you are selecting the front view okay so to zoom this one so that you can have a clear view you can roll forward your mouse wheel okay so position at the center you can roll and move down you can simply point here and then hold down your mouse wheel hold down and then drag so that you can pan at the center okay so this time the active is the front view okay so we're going to draw here in the front view so for example we're going to draw shape and we're going to use the packet tool okay so instance to draw in the front you click here on this face to select and then you click the create sketch okay so after you click the create sketch you can now draw the shape you want to put here on the front view okay so uh, for instance you're going to draw here circle you click this one and then you click center and rim point click this one then you can draw circle. okay then click okay so after you click you select you right click here stop the active tool which is the circle right click and then this time select the circle so that you can select by clicking and then you can set the dimension to for instance you're going to drag to center you point at the center of the circle okay so for instance here center and then you can now set the dimension to constrain auto radius to uh, for example uh, 5 only 5 millimeter and then you click for instance 10 and then you click okay okay so next you have already drawn circle in the front view okay so you can click the close and this time this time you can now use the packet tool so to click this packet tool this will create a packet in the selected sketch so the selected sketch now is the circle I click this one then you can see here the dimensions or the properties for the packet tool okay so for instance you can put only two millimeter for length for the packet okay so then you can click okay this time you can actually rotate this one by simply holding down the mouse wheel and then hold down your left mouse button and then you can rotate you can see you have already apply the packet tool so this will actually engrave your uh, design okay so next we're going to draw on the top 
view okay select the top view then this time we can pan hold down your mouse wheel drag down to move and then this face this is actually the top view click this one okay then do the same like you do in the front okay so you click create a sketch then this time you draw uh, for instance another shape so for example you draw pentagon you click this one and then you can draw pentagon here okay, click and then to stop the active tool right click your mouse and then point here and then you can move to the center okay so you can set here at the circle and then you can set the dimension to the circle is 10 so do the same 10 millimeter okay so next do the same you click the close then you click the get tool this one and this time I have already a pocket for if we rotate this one you can see it's five so that's too deep so you can change this one to only millimeter and then click okay so next you can care the right then you can move you can find on the right view like this face do the same click this one and then click create a sketch and select another shape so for instance hexagon you draw the hexagon here click, and then you can move right click to stop then move at the center at the center and then you click here then set to one and click okay. and do the same you click close then you click the pocket tool okay set to two millimeter click okay so this time uh will create a design for the rare so click the rare rare view and then click this face and then you can see here a create sketch okay select another shape heptagon for example you draw here click right click and then click the circle i mean you move this one at the center click the circle and then set to 10 is the radius then click ok then do the same you click close you click the pocket tool ok then set 2 millimeter and then click ok next you do at the bottom view ok so click this one do the same and then click create sketch and then draw another shape so for instance you want to use the polyline you can create a polyline and then you can actually make you can draw here for instance i'm going to draw letter c Okay, so next, right click to stop the active tool, which is the fully line, and then click close. You, you make sure that you have a close path. Click close, and then you can use now the packet tool. Okay, so next, set to 2, and then click. Okay, so the last view is the left view okay so click the left view and then click this left view face and then create sketch and then for example you can use the again the polyline you can draw any uh, shape here click the polyline uh, for instance this is a letter for example click Letter T for instance. For example only. Okay, so after you draw or after you make a close path, you can click here to stop active tool and then click close. 
and then do the same you click the packet tool and then set to 2 and then click ok so this time you are now done creating designs on the sec 6 views ok so you can now this isometric view so that you can see all and zoom out by simply rolling your wheel and this time you have already drawn its shape in its views so you can hold down your mouse wheel and then your left mouse button and then you can now rotate your 3d model okay so that's all how to draw the six views of six views in FreeCAD and to use the packet tool okay so if you're new to my channel please consider subscribing and hit the notification bell so that you will be updated of all the videos tutorials templates that i'm going to upload thank you so much for watching